Rangers hosting the Astros, and the Astros are minus 170 on the money line. The Rangers are plus 155. The over-under is seven runs. The Astros, laying a run and a half, are plus 110, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by two. The Rangers, getting a run and a half, are minus 130, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Valdez has pitched three times against the Rangers this year. Six in innings, one run, it wasn't earned, and they lost that game 6-2, to two, and that was in Texas. Seven innings, one run, one earned. They won that game 5-1. to one. And when I say it was in Texas, I mean it was at the Rangers ballpark. So, circle back to that. Seven innings, no runs, no earned. They won that game 7-3. to three. Dunning has pitched twice against the Astros, and both times he pitched, he was home. Five and two-thirds, two runs, two earned. They won that game 6-2. to two. Six innings, no runs, no earned. They lost that game 4-3. to three. The Astros are 68-61 and 61 on the run line, seven games over 500. They won their last game. They're 6-4 and four in their last 10. They are 39-27 and 27 on the road. They've won Valdez's last four starts. They're 16-8 and eight with him on the mound. And the under is 13-10-1 in the games in which he pitches in. The Rangers are 72-55 and 55 on the run line. They've actually been exceptional. They've lost their last two games. They're 6-4 in their last 10, 28-36 and 36 at home. They are 8-16 and 16 as a team with Dunning on the mound. The over has hit in his last three games. However, he is also, the under is 13-10-1 when he pitches. Head-to-head, -head, the Astros are 7-3 and three in their last 10 against the Rangers. There have been two one-run games in their last 10 meetings. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs is 5-5. Five five. The over has hit in their last four games. The under is 6-4. The home team is six and four. The over seven is five, three, and two. I'm going Astros with the money line, Astros laying the runs. And the only reason I'm going over is because it is so low. And when you look at the scores of a handful of these games that these guys pitched against the opposing team, it's seven or eight anyway. So I have a feeling this might be a push. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.